So guys, it has come down to this. This is the finale. The final part of the finale, I must say. Uh, thank you so much for all the support. If you're excited for the next season of this game, I don't know when it's going to be. I don't know when. It might be next year. It might be later this year. I have no idea, but uh, I don't know. If you enjoy this finale, just destroy that like button and uh, leave me a... I don't know. Leave me like your favorite Telltale series. I'm just curious. I'm, I'm just really eager to read what people put because I've always talked about the ones I like, but uh, this has just been a fantastic one. So I love you guys, and let's do this. Yo, Batman's already <laughs> struggling right now. This is gonna be the Batman. final Got area, a maybe. On Joker and Wallace. Doesn't look like he's hurt her. Not yet. I'm in the rafters, out of sight. Say the word if you need help. Thanks. Bruce, I know you and Waller have your differences, but she doesn't deserve this. I take complete responsibility. Batman. So the camera can pick it up. Took you long enough. Batman! Thank God! I mean, I assumed you'd be okay. You're Batman, for Pete's sake. But still, are you okay, buddy? I was really worried about you. I'm fine. Of course you are. No way would a couple pesky bombs take you out. <laughs> Things got crazy on that roof, huh? I had to do something. Waller was about to walk away. But get this. I'm this close to getting Waller to admit to every terrible thing she's ever done. And when that's over, I'll deliver her punishment. It'll, of course, have to reflect the enormity of her crimes. The only enormity I'm seeing is your jail sentence. You're the one who needs to be put away, Joker. What? I'm just a well-intentioned guy who sometimes makes teensy mistakes. She's practically a, a war criminal. You know, I, I don't know why you're not more into this. Think of everything she's put you through. Everyone is disposable to her, even her own agents. I know I've made mistakes. You try to do the right thing, but there's always a cost. Just ask your pal Batman there. He'll say the same thing. I do what I do for a reason. I'm not ashamed. Don't play innocent. I play to win. When I lose, good people die. <laughs> what the f You're totally right. She sucks! Let's keep the show rolling. We've heard your excuses. You didn't mean for people to get hurt. Collateral damage, yada yada yada. But... There's one crime that can't be excused. You killed the Riddler! And then you tried to pin it on me! I didn't kill him, like I said. It was you! You killed Riddler! Say it! I will not. If there's one thing I learned by watching you, violence solves a lot of problems! Oh my goodness. No. God, Batman, stay out of my way. You need a distraction. Well, I get my confession. The way boss talked about you, I thought you'd be better.
like how he was aiming like side to side, you know? Like it's not running straight at you, man. Yo, that's the clothesline from hell right there. <laughs> Love it. Was. I've given everything to protect this city. Delusions of grandeur much! Yet another thing you have in common with Waller! Trying to do things your way was a mistake. Waller killed Riddler. <gasps> and she deserved death! It wasn't Waller! Tiffany? I can't let someone else pay for my crimes. Waller didn't kill Riddler. I did. I know it was wrong. Now. Uh, God, are you kidding me? These are the people you want to protect. I should kill them both. Everyone here is guilty. <laughs> this, is a, this is a joke. Get back, Tiffany. No, I've kept this in the dark for too long. I used a drone and these. There's your proof. You want to sacrifice yourself for Waller? Then go ahead. Just hold on. Murder is wrong. Trust the system. Violence isn't the answer. People just pick and choose. Well, get up, man. Believe. Come on. And you're no different. Like he's about to Just fall on that stuff and really become the Joker. Together. This is how it is. I'll get you help. I won't abandon you. You want me to go back to the beginning? To Arkham? Where it all started? I've been so far since then, Batman. Because of you. I believed in you, Batman. Oh shit! Dang, look at that that shaking though. That's so graphic. It's Joker! The 
That's enough. Yo, this ending is sick so far. I love it. I'm just waiting for it. He has to fall in the stuff or whatever. The chemicals. I'm just... I'm waiting for it to happen. It's gonna be by accident. I know it. Uppercut. That telltale blood, though. Like, are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah, man, he's just going everywhere, isn't he? good job with just how he is the Joker now you know I don't I mean it just kind of came out of left field at the start of the episode but now it's like I'm used to it to think his character just like a really good version of the Joker and Batman is taking some stabs tonight Jeez. Headbutt max voltage. I did at one point, Someone but not anymore. You actually c care about? Of course. Of course you were my friend. <laughs> you are one messed up guy. <laughs> we'll never forget that. Wow. I think the circumstances allow. Gordon was telling me how you found me. Sounds like top drawer detective work. It was a team effort. 
Batman led the charge. It's not easy to say this, but it looks like you saved my life. I guess that puts me in your debt. It's what I do. I save people. It's a shame we couldn't have saved more. I've got a lot of unpleasant phone calls to make. Jim, would you mind giving us a minute? Batman and I have some unfinished business. I'll go check on Joker's transfer, make sure they don't take any chances. Just try not to rip each other's heads off, okay? We can all play nice now that the bad guy's in cuffs. You don't have to worry. Our stalemate from the roof still stands. I'm pulling out of Gotham effective immediately. Then why are we still talking? Tiffany Fox. Riddler's death may have caused a lot of problems, but I won't make her pay for it. I'll leave that to the man who can't stand killing. I know you think I'm the devil, but I want you to understand. I didn't want... I didn't see things going down like this. I let the mission get out from under me. Never really regained a solid footing. I know how you feel. Well, look at that. You and me on the same page for once. I just came here to round up the pact. Quick and easy. And if Riddler led you to Sanctus, that would have been a bonus. Listen. Everything I did, I did for the greater good. To protect Gotham, to uphold the law, to make the world a safer place. Whatever your reasons, you went too far. You escalated things on the bridge. You got people killed. And coming after me? What were you thinking? You sided with that maniac. What was I supposed to do? Give you a medal? You act so high and mighty. At the end of the day, you're just a rich guy with all the toys beating up on lunatics. I deal with criminals who threaten my city. You're so far up your own ass, you can't see the truth. You're as nuts as any of them. Avesta had you pegged the minute she walked in your office. She started listing off your pals. All those friends of yours who went cuckoo. How do you think I catch them? I need to be to do what I do. I'd have to agree. We're done here. Signal the withdrawal. I'm not gonna miss her, that's for sure. So, here we are once again. Gotham's safe because of you. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it felt pretty good getting my hands dirty. Just like old times, huh? Truth is, after I got ousted, I didn't know my place anymore. Turned into an old guy in civvies, lurking around crime scenes. We have to work together, Jim. Solve cases. Lock up the scum who terrorize our streets. I'd like that. So would I. Oh, uh, I gotta take this. Wife probably saw the news. <laughs> See you around, Batman. Don't be a stranger. Tiffany. 
We need to talk. Yeah, I figured. You're hurt. It's nothing. I saw you take much worse. Joker was going to cut Waller ear to ear. I had to create a distraction. It was certainly distracting. My confession. It took you by surprise, didn't it? I just couldn't keep it in anymore. You know I don't condone killing. Not even scum like Riddler. I've been dreading this moment. Especially since I learned who you are under that mask. I was afraid of what might happen if you found out. I guess I was hoping you never would. Why didn't you talk to me sooner? I... I wanted to work with you, to be part of your mission. But you kept this from me. A murder? I know. I'm sorry. I knew this would ruin everything. You were right. Riddler tore my family apart, Bruce. My mother hasn't left the house since the funeral. And Luke? He just lashes out. My father's death broke them. It broke all of us. I won't ask for forgiveness. But I hope you can understand why I had to do it. I just felt so powerless. Like my life was crumbling around me. Revenge is an impulse, one to be checked. I can't condone it. But I do understand it. Thank you. That means a lot. I couldn't bear it if you despised me. So, where do we go from here? I suppose this puts me on your most wanted list. Rather than us working... If you want to fill your father's shoes, you need to learn right from wrong. You need someone to teach you. You're giving me a second chance? Think of it more as a sentence. You'll have to work hard for your redemption. I promise I won't let you down. Then let's get started. It's like, that's cool, how come I don't have one of those? I was going to write a note. But I'm not a coward. At least I don't want to be. Not anymore. Then again, this won't be the first time I've found my courage in a single malt. Courage for what? Saying goodbye. I'm leaving, Bruce. It's time I went in search of better pastures. You just need rest, Alfred. Why don't you take a long vacation? Like we talked about. Some place in the sun, on the other side of the world from Gotham. I rather think this vacation will be permanent. But why? This war of ours is not what it was when we started. I no longer have the stomach for it. It's not sustainable. At least not for me. Come on, Alfred. You know I can't do what I do, what we do, without your help. Well, maybe you don't have to do it at all. Our mission used to be so clear. Catch the criminals, lock them up. But nothing is clear anymore, at least not to me. Now everything has become so gray. <laughs> gray? Talk to me, Alfred. We used John Doe, exploited his friendship to get you into the pact. We took advantage of someone you met in an asylum, for God's sake. Someone clearly challenged with a proven tendency to violence. I'll admit that wasn't our finest moment, 
but at the time it seemed like our best course of action. Precisely my point. Our best judgment is no longer good enough. You empowered John Doe, kept him close when you should have put him away, inspired him to become something far more dangerous than he ever was. What's your point? Sometimes it's as if Batman creates the evil he means to destroy. For all our good intentions, I fear we only make things worse. A dreadful thought, I know, but one that keeps me awake at night. Oh, please. There were plenty of criminals around before Batman showed up. I put most of them in jail. Two-Face, Cobblepot, Lady Arkham, Joker, all they have in common is you. Anyone who comes into contact with us suffers. Lucius is gone. Tiffany has blood on her hands. I foolishly thought bringing her in might make things better. As if her enthusiasm might remind us how things were in the beginning. We put her in danger on her first day, dodging machine guns at a crime scene. The lives we touch are touched by pain. Friends, colleagues, innocents. No one is spared. You think I want that? We can fix the problem, Al, but not if we run from it. Unless we are the problem. Leaving this all behind might be the only solution. One thing is for certain, my tremors are gone. <laughs> That's great news, Al. They stopped the minute I made the decision to go. I thought it was the kidnapping with Lady Arkham that caused them. Some kind of residual trauma. But I had it wrong. This sense of powerlessness I've been feeling, it came from something I saw in you. The tremors, the fainting spells, all of it. Alfred, I'm... I'm so sorry. I've caused you so much pain. No, no, please don't misunderstand me. Let me explain. Your father was driven by an obsession, by a need to control. He rushed headlong into the darkness, thinking himself invincible, oblivious to the cost. Just like you. Not like me. I chase that darkness away. And yet, history is repeating itself. I'm more certain of that with every passing day. Okay, maybe I am more like my father than I want to admit, but our paths are different. Can't you see? The paths may diverge, but they end in the same place. Face down in an alley, shot in the dark by criminals in some godforsaken corner of Gotham. I won't be witness to that. I won't bury you, too. I stood by and did nothing while Thomas destroyed himself along with everything he loved. I enabled him, like I'd been enabling you. Realizing this, I've never felt so helpless. I wanted things to be different for you, my boy. You deserved a better life than the one I gave you. I failed you, and for that I'm sorry. Alfred, I'm... <laughs> I'm nothing without you. You're my father. The best father anyone could have hope for. A good father wants his children to be happy and safe. Seeing how far you are from either, it's why I have to go. Well, I don't want to miss my flight. There's always traffic around the airport. You don't have to do it, Bruce. There are other ways of doing good in the world. But you, you pour everything into your bloody crusade. And I know you too well to hope you'll ever change. I've got to pick between being Batman or Bruce Wayne right now, but I'm gonna give up Batman. It just seems like the better of the two. Alfred, wait. I don't want to lose Alfred, you know? Would you stay if I promised things would be different? Is that a promise you can keep? Like you said, there are a lot of ways to help. I'm sure the city could use a man of my 
talent and resources. Are you sure about this? I'll do whatever it takes to keep our family together, Al. Even this. So please, tell me you'll stay. Well, maybe just one more night. Hey, I got him to stay. I was worried for me, he's just determined. Same stitch. That was an awesome episode, guys. Evaluate your choices. All right, <laughs> let's see the damage. Your choices are ready, okay. Holly Quinn. You got that look in your eye. The kind that says Dang, you're right down the middle. 50.1%. Yes, I was I was with the majority, guys. Alright, let's go to the next one. This is gonna be a tough one, I feel like. I feel like I'm gonna lose this one. 40. Alright, alright. Oh god damn hurricane. Alright, I'm not too mad at that. Please tell me I'm on the good side of this. Yeah! Safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! We got Catwoman. Alright, let's see what we got here. Come on, be something. I weighed my options and what can I say? I don't like to lose. Really? You and 2.6%? Damn, like... <laughs> I don't know, like, that's such a... I... Uh, out of all the people, because I'm playing this uh, a little while after the episode came out, I'm kind of surprised at that. 2.6%? Really? I don't know when I did that. It is what it is. All right. People had to give her a second chance. Yeah, I was I about to say, take her under your wing. 80%. That's more like it. This one's a tough one. It's going to be a... a criminally okay, insane. I'm in the majority again. You're drawn to them, aren't you? So it's kind of cool how they did that. All right. If a man hides in plain sight, Gave up the mantle of Batman. I'm pretty sure everybody chose to stay Batman, but I felt like you picking that, he helped you do everything. He's trying to leave. You give up something for him. I feel like the next episode or next season of Batman, it'll be something like uh, you're, you know, Bruce Wayne for a little while, and then all of a sudden, he gets guilty feeling like you need to go help people and then it just works itself out. So that's kind of irrelevant. It's the end of the season, you know? All right, here we go. It's going to be a tough one. Hey, 54%. The same stitch bound together, even under strain. That was pretty sick. All right, did you save Willie? Uh, hesitated. Seven. So. 70% saved the other guy besides the agent. That's pretty extreme. Okay, that was normal. This is just, now this is just for the episode. The other thing was for the season, I think. Alright. What about this one? 5.7% refused to hear his last words. Never give up, Batman. I didn't really give him up, but it just shows at the end of the game. <laughs> I'm gonna keep playing as him, you know? Alright, defeated vigilante joke. Nice. I'm just, I'm really surprised that one thing with uh, Catwoman. Two point something percent? You kidding me? Photos collected. Oh, yeah, I remember seeing all those. Alright, guys. Well, uh, I guess I will see you in the next Telltale game. Uh oh, hold on. Visitor for John Doe. Bruce! <laughs> hmm. I'm not sure what that's all about. 
Not sure at all, guys.